This is the original Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera, and these are some vintage lenses made for Bolex. Bolex was founded in 1925 for a Swiss camera manufacturer specialising in 16 and Super 16mm film format cameras. The cameras are beautiful. Uh, if you struggle to use film cameras, then they are a bugger to use. But if you find their image desirable, then they are definitely worth trying to use. But I don't have the money to shoot and develop 16mm film. So I've got to try the next best thing. With a cheap adapter from Amazon, you can take vintage lenses like these that were originally made for 16mm film cameras, and you can put them on modern day ones. While I could make it easy and say this is the only made for video camera I have, I don't have the 4K or a 6K model, but I don't see myself upgrading anytime soon. I'm happy with this package, and I don't particularly want to invest hundreds if not thousands of pounds on lenses, because I'm happy with these ones. The main reason why I'm still so happy with this camera can be summed up by its Super 16 sensor. There's something magical about partnering vintage lenses with the original Blackmagic. It's obviously an imitation of film, but it's the closest thing I've found to it. Especially without abusing lots of LUTs and filters in the edit. I use this camera all the time for run and gun stuff because it's literally kind of point and shoot size. The form factor is so small, it's just got the lens which sits very tight to the camera body, and I've got an external battery mount which is, you know, a little bit like a makeshift grip really. And so I can find myself just putting it in my pocket, taking it out, shooting something, and putting it back quite easy something you definitely can't get if you're going out with your Blackmagic 4K. Even when I don't use the Bolex lenses, I just use vintage lenses my mum had in the 80s. And I just bought a cheap 20 quid adapter, and that's what I shoot on, that's what I do photography on, that's what I do basically any shooting on. And I love them. I think there's something enriching with these older lenses. There's a lot of downsides, but there's a lot of upsides and I don't really want to spend hundreds and thousands of pounds on upgrading. At least not yet. I'd much rather use what I've got and develop how I tell stories than rush and buy equipment that might get outdated or, you know, uh, I might want to step to something better in the future. That can all come. Right now, I want to work on stories and character and composition. And I think then you can go out and you know, spend money on lenses. I'm not too quick to go and upgrade any of my old vintage lenses. And I actually would really recommend you just go on eBay, trying to find a couple of these old lenses, make sure you figure out exactly what mount that you've got, which adapters you'd need, because there's no point buying a bunch of vintage lenses that all have different mounts, and you've only got one adapter and then that one won't fit, you know, so do your research. If you like these Bolex lenses that I've sort of used in this video, they're C-screw, uh, and I'll link the adapter I bought down in the description. And I would really recommend checking it out and at least considering using some older glass. You, know, you might find yourself uh, sticking with it.